Hey guys, Mike Sorg at Sorgatron on Twitter with another awesome cast tech sec. Real quick, I want to talk about uh, The Verge reporting uh, in the last 24 hours here. Microsoft reportedly buys Sunrise, the best calendar app for iPhone and Android, and I completely agree with that. This is something I've been using for several, several months now, actually, looking for something. And, and really, I'm still using Google Calendar. This is really just an interface for Google Calendar. and, and and Microsoft is buying it. We've talked about on the show, on the main show, how excited we've been about what Microsoft's been doing. Um, and, 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 you know, guys, this is my fault. I'm so sorry if, you're, if you don't like this news. Uh, because just like two days ago, I was sitting there on a uh, Windows 8 machine uh, trying to figure out some stuff because I just had to use it for, for, for a couple days um, instead of my Mac. And saying, man, how is this calendar app? Everywhere else, every other platform except for this Windows machine. Well, I guess it's going to be a little different now. Um, is it an interest? There was a comment on Daily Tech News Show today of uh, you're going to be end up. I'm going to end up using a Microsoft product to interface with like Google Calendar in the near future on my iOS device. This is the world we're living in now. This is the new Microsoft, and it's great technology. It's a great calendar. Uh, I use it for scheduling. Some of you guys out there uh, have gotten the emails from me from Sunrise for the uh, events, and, and it's really helped kind of organize that aspect of my life a little bit more so than Google Calendar by itself would have. Because it's not, you know, it's not just like, hey, it's Google Calendar. I'm inviting Google Calendar invites and stuff. Um, but it's really nice, and then it has everything in there. Um, it's just an easier way to plug things in, whether I'm on the phone or if I'm on my laptop. Uh, so go check it out. It's in the, <laughs> if you want to go check it out, it's uh, cal it's calendar.sunrise.am. And there's actually an online version now, too, like a web version when you log in there with your Google account or Facebook or however, however you might have it set up. Uh, which I, I didn't know about it. So you can use it on, on a Windows platform now. And I'm sure there'll be a Windows 10 app version in the near future. So go check that out. Some pretty big news. Um, hey, at least I know it'll be around because I was always wondering, how are these guys making money? It's a free app. But there you go. They get bought by Microsoft. And, uh, and, and there you go. Um, so uh, check out this and a whole lot more awesomecast.net with other uh, tech sex. And please check out Sorgatron.com. I'm about to record it right after this. We're going to talk a little bit about this new net neutrality news. As much as I understand it, figure it need a little bit more time than the tech sec had to offer. And I'm sure it'll be a, a further discussion on a main awesomecast show next Tuesday night live at about 6.37 uh, p.m. Eastern time at live.awesomecast.net. We'll see you guys next time. This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com.